One woman has dedicated her entire life to creating a safe place that provides vocational training for intellectually disabled and challenged young adults. Photojournalist Daniel Alvarado brings us the report with the founder of the House of the Sycamore Tree, Micaiah Pettigrew. At the House of the Sycamore Tree, they've got a safe environment where they can come and um, get some social skills and some vocational training provided for them in a safe environment. Well, it's very rewarding to um, just get to see our kids um, have a life outside of school. It would be wonderful for anybody um, to come out and help. We have lots of different ways that you can help. Um, in the summer we'll start volunteer where if you pay $25 an hour our team comes out and volunteers to do whatever you need done like mowing lawns, washing your cars, um, carrying stuff to your attic, whatever you need done. And when you volunteer and you get to work hand in hand with our special needs guys, it's a very, very rewarding experience because they they love like no other. They work harder than any other. Um, everything to them is so special. They'll be watching tonight. So is there a message that you'd like to give them? Um, I just want them to know that how proud I am of them for all their accomplishments and everything they do and how hard they work. And I'm glad that they show up um, every Tuesday and put, it, put all their effort into being successful. <laughs> Daniel, thanks so much. Ms. Pettigrew tells us that they're having a clay shoot April 18th. To support the organization, anyone looking for more info can visit CBS7.com. And coming up after the break, it's puppy season here in the basin. If you're looking for a new friend for the family, the Odessa Animal Shelter has two furry friends waiting for their forever homes. You're watching CBS7 News, your eye on West Texas. <laughs> 